I'm Samantha Loren, your St. Martin Parish reporter. Baseball season is less than one month away, and one parent is raising concerns over the safety of St. Martinville Senior High School's dugout's collapsed roof. These kids are having to play in something that's unsafe and definitely not appealing to the eye. Bo Amon's son plays for the Tigers baseball team. He believes his son and teammates shouldn't have to play in these types of conditions. The dressing room is un unable to be used, period. Uh, the dugout is still there, but it's definitely not a stable condition in, for these kids to be in. The school currently uses Magnolia City Park's baseball field because of their lease agreement with the city. The school is responsible for maintenance of the facility. As a parent, I do believe it's the school board's uh, problem that they should be fixing it, funding it as well, because it is our students that use it and we are taxpayers of the parish, so they should be taking care of it. I spoke with baseball coach Kyle Poirier. He says at a school board meeting last April, he voiced his concerns over the dugout and locker room. Poirier says he was told it was not a top priority. Frederick Wiltz is the St. Martin Parish School superintendent. He believes there was confusion over who was responsible for the repairs because it was due to rain damage. One of the, the, the big solutions is to try to come together with the city and repair the damage that's been done to the area where they're playing it so that they can at least use it until we can have a home permanent facility. Wilt says the school district plans on building a baseball stadium on the high school's property, but that's not likely for the next two seasons. As for plans in the near future... For now, what we want to try to do is make it as safe as possible and kind of block off that area that has been damaged by the storm so that they can use the, the dugout itself. The dugout is going to be cut off so that they won't be able to use the dugout. Wilt says this week an 18-wheeler storage container for gear will be brought here for the team's use. Reporting in St. Martin Parish, Samantha Loren, KTC TV3.